we leave behind Sidagmon Square and hand up to Kovonaki, which has been considered the most aristocratic neighborhood in Athens for decades. We pass through Bucharestiu pedestrianized road which is filled with designer ateliers. It's hard to think of something you can't find in this area. If we don't get stuck looking through a shop window or in a cafe, we reach Kolonaki's famous square. I imagine the three statues of Xanthos, Chakalov and Skufas, the three men who took an oath and paved the way for the Greek Revolution. Watch all the people that crowd this square day and night with some confusion. Here you will find politicians who have popped over from parliament for a coffee, journalists, famous Athenians and regular folks, as well as fashion models and designers. It is always packed and gives you the feeling that life here is more exciting and that you are participating in it. Why is called Kolonaki? Because in ancient Greek it means small hill. And yes, it is just below a hill. Look at it all. Just before the top of the hill, we find the Xamenei Square, filled with cafes and restaurants. At the top of the hill, there is a temple, Agios Georgios, St. George. From its veranda, you can see Athens from above. Okay, Weddings and christenings are held here. Here, there is a wonderful cafe and a restaurant where you can enjoy the view. It is wonderful up here. Follow me. Oh!